guys and welcome back to another Houndoom Opens. And once again I am greeted I was for a short period greeted by Jirachi you may want to think mm, again, you greeted once again. And that's because earlier I tried to record a video but uh, yeah I made a mistake so uh yeah yeah. So I already claimed the um daily reward which is the ticket. So tomorrow uh, Wednesday we'll get a card back. And uh yeah, and when I went to go record a video earlier, it when I started it it was on this, it was on Jirachi, so go right into it and a few things I told I was saying I uh, trying to let y'all know is a see I, I did definitely fix it in case y'all was wondering. I'm not sure I'm fun to thing anytime soon, maybe I'm forgetting to fix it. No. I fixed it, I just didn't want to play with it for a little bit. Now I'm gonna play it though. Um Why is he always at the advantage? The people opposite of me always have to sleep, always have to advantage when I'm playing fun of thing. But anyway, um, the project that made me get off YouTube for a while, well, didn't really make me get off YouTube, but I just got off it to work on a project to refinish it. Um, it's coming along nicely. It's just gonna take me a little bit to finish it, but it's going nice. Um, also, Sunday, I'm not always gonna post a video on Sunday. Every now and then I will, because I'm, as you can see right now, I'll be honest. I'm, um, I'm back in school. I'm getting back in school. So yeah, yeah, I got work to do. Unfortunate. Well, fortunately, and unfortunately, unfortunately, because it takes a lot of time. Fortunately, because I need to have an education so I can do business. Right now, YouTube's basically my job, and I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying YouTube. But I'm having to. I'm gonna have to record videos a little later in the day. I won't always do Sunday videos just because I won't always feel like it. Um, damn, thing does about everything I said. And uh, apart from the fact I was, didn't know what to talk about, <laughs> Maybe that's the problem I had over here. <laughs> I didn't know what to talk about, really. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Did you mind? Yeah, just, just, just did you mind? <laughs> Pokemon and Digimon, that's basically all I've been doing is just like watching some stuff, getting ideas for something. I'm, I, uh, I play, I play some games, and uh, one of the games I play has a built in recorder, so, and I didn't know if my OBS studio would actually might record it either, but I thought about maybe, um, recording gameplay. So, not necessarily yet. Don't know if it'll work, but yeah. So you might have game videos. My channel will still be Houndoom, even though my username is something else, like my username for games or something, something else. Cause I might make a, I might make another channel f for games. Like this is my Pokemon channel. Where I play Pokemon Online TCG and do Pokemon stuff, and I have another channel where I do games or game. Cause there's only like one game I can think of which has multiple games on it. If that gives it any hints. The ends of her uh, ends of her uh, blocks. Just just that's a that's a good hint for y'all. It's a game that has several games into it and it's called in in, in, in part of its name is blocks. There that, that, that's a good hint for y'all. It's gonna take a while. But I've been doing a lot of gaming, watching some Digimon and I hope most of y'all know what Digimon is, but for those of y'all who don't know what Digimon is, it's kinda like Pokemon only instead of like pocket monsters, it's digital monsters. And the storyline as far as I, I've not seen it in a long time, but I thought I'd be watching it. I'm watching some of the different versions, because you have like, Digimon Adventures, which is the main, main show. Then you also have, um, Digimon Tamers, which is entirely something else. But, you have, um, basically, like, people who, you know, the internet, banks, all that stuff. Well, the internet that connects it all created another world. A war of digital monsters. When Digimon Tamers, it's like um, Digimon Tamers. It's different. Digimon Tamers. The story is basically um, kind of uh, okay. AKA this might be really, but so AKA spoiler alert <laughs> if you don't want anything spoiled from Digimon. But basically, the the story, as far as I know and remember from Digimon Tamers. It's basically scientists created Digimon. Oh, the guy gave up. Yeah, the guy was not doing well. B basically, they created uh, digital monsters, but 
if the AI got too small and so they try to destroy all Digimon and make it into a children's game. Yeah, the Digimon somehow survived because Digimon and they started and Digimon Tamers they started leaking into the real world, finding ways to make the, the make data creatures into real life bodies and stuff and as monsters in the real world. Some's good, some's bad. And you have Digimon Tamers who are these people who own Digimon and have Digimodify cards. Which modify your Digimon to give them boost to help them win a fight. And that was a good fun thing, but doing now I want to play with Cust Jungle. Da -da 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 -da. Um and who is the advantage? Nobody has the advantage. Oh, that guy's got a triple element deck. Ooh. But uh, of course I'm yawning again. Oh yeah, I'm ahead. Oh yeah, so I'm gonna tell us now. Shoot my heads again. <laughs> but in any case, um Yeah. And Digimon Tamers do you have the modifying cards, but in the original Digimon, um a few kids got lucky and was said to be the Digi Destined. And basically they were these people who the kids who received Digivices. And even Digimon Tamers you have Digivices. But that sent the kids or the Digi Destined into the Digi Ward where they got the Digimon and they had a fight. It's really good stuff. Y'all should watch uh y'all should watch some Digimon, it's really good. It's like Pokemon. Pokemon and Digimon are some of my favorite shows. Cause it's just really really cool. One of my favorite Digimon from the original is Agumon's Digilution line. And another reason it's kinda like Pokemon is your Digimon Digivolve only in Pokemon, your po unless it's Mega Evolution, normal Pokemon undigivolve. I mean, normal Pokemon undigivolve. We, we, I'm getting tongue tied. Normal Pokemon do not uh, unevolve. Only Megas will devolve back to normal. Unless you're playing the TCG and then you use the devolution card, or the devolution de spray, and I'm pretty sure that's just what does it. Um. And of course you're going for Eevee, so let me guess, maybe Espeon, or Gracian, or um, Umbreon, let me guess, one of those GXs, in any case, um, let me guess, Umbreon GX, but, um, Digimon, I, <sighs> I cannot shake this tiredness, though. but in any case, uh, one of the main things is, um, in the Digiward, like each Digimon, like most Digimon, well not all, but some Digimon will have baby forms, but will have like uh, I call it pink form because most of them's pink, some of them's not. And like Kurumon, that's Agumon's so form, Kurumon. And once they Digivolve into the next form, they don't undigivolve from that. Like Kurumon Digivolve into Agumon, and then Agumon is Agumon. And unless Agumon Digivolves again or uses a lot of energy, he won't go back to Kurumon. Like Kurumon. Yeah, I'm having like I'm I'm gonna get tired. I can't talk every now like every now and then. But anyway, once Agumon digivolves into Greymon, he usually digivolves back into good old Agumon. Except if he uses like a uh, energy or digivolves again. And he used all me Doom moves, put all energy one, two, three, uh, put all energy attached to into your hand at the end of your press next turn the defending Pokemon will be knocked out. What? Oi, beef! I mean, oi! Oi, vey, oi, vey, oi, vey. Mmm, that's kind of damage counters, dude, that would be useless. Um, I'm gonna use horn attack, and I could, I'm gonna faint. Uh, uh, Taurus is gonna faint, and yeah, game over. That was a very fast game. But in any case, yeah, once you go to Greymon, then you get tags and quest, and you get the quest put into the tag, and you can digivolve further. And Greymon has, in the show, Greymon has like two digilutions he can go into. One is by force, one is by choice. Like, the one he's supposed to digivolve into is Metal Greymon, who looks very awesome. But if he's forced, in which you have the kid named Ty, which is, um, Agumon's owner, or Digidescent, <coughs> and Yeet will open up a Celestial Storm Pack collection, and um, basically he he originally forced a, a Greymon to Digivolve 
for the not letting him but forced which is very mean but he apologized later uh and he digivolves into skull greymon who's like one of my favorite digimon of all time okay we got some new cards we gotta look at first okay draw the cards in this cut off hand uh i like these cards that like crocheted and stuff that looks so cool and that um ball toy does look cool used to look cool and we pull Reggie Ice, Ice, Icy Barrier. As long as this Pokemon is added to Pokemon, your opponent can't play any Stadium cards. Hmm. Not the best pack I ever opened, but yep. <laughs> but in any case, yeah, Digimon is really cool. You should check it out. I was just like a lot of time talking about Digimon in this Pokemon video. But I guess I'm gonna end it here. I might be a little bit of a short video considering that guy knocked me out pretty fast, but I did do that one video. So, next video, I sh yeah, next video I will be opening up a Pokemon Online TCG pack for my daily rewards right here, and then also I'll be building I'll be building a new deck, and what deck I'll be building will be a surprise. D <laughs> so yeah, I guess that's it. I'm just, I'm just trying to figure out a cool intro and outro for these videos. <laughs> Um, yeah. So I guess this is like, I, I just end the clip and I just like, I press the button and I end the recording, like, boop, and it just like stops. So, okay. Bye. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> Catch you on next video.